I want to show you a tip diffracted signal. What I have is a carbon steel block. This block of steel is one inch thick and this block has an EDM notch cut in it all the way through the, the whole width. This is about an inch and a half wide block. It's an inch thick and this EDM notch I don't know how well you can see it, but it's 300 thousandths. So I have this one inch thick block, a notch 300 thousandths, and I'm going to show you a tip diffracted signal, and it will tell you how deep this tip is, and so it'll tell you uh, how much through wall, or from the bottom, or from the ID of this bar, how long is that. I measured it as 300 thousandths, but I'll show you how to do it ultrasonically. And this is basically uh, the setup. I'm using a 45 degree transducer, uh, 4 megahertz, my Olympus uh, Epic 1000 I machine. And this is my block. It's one inch thick. And in this case, I have the notch is 300 thousandths deep. And I'm going to place my 45 degree transducer on here and I'm going to find that that crack, that ID connected crack. So I'm using a 45 because it is the perfect corner trap. I can hit the corner of this ID connected notch and it will uh, it will ring the tip tip diffraction the sound will ring from that tip. And we will see it on the screen and I can actually measure the depth of that tip and subtract it from the thickness of my part and that will be uh, the depth or, or how much through wall this crack is. So um, I'm going to uh, use my transducer and point it in this direction. Uh, I've calibrated my machine using an IIW block and um, I set up my full screen width is uh, 2.8 inches and the reason I did that at 45 degrees one inch thick um, the full V skip is 2.8 inches my ID would be mid screen and then the top of my uh, of, of this uh, bar would be out here at the very end so for simplicity's sake I'm going to just lay this transducer down And right there, we can see, let me bring this gain down. This is my ID connected notch. Let me try to peek this guy up. I'm going to go back and forth, peek it. There's my peak. Take my gate, move my gate over this signal. Turn off the peak memory. Take it 80% full screen height. And we can see the depth is 0.990. That is the corner trap that's right down here. That is my part thickness. This signal is hitting here. Let me increase the gain and we'll see if that tip starts to show up. And it is starting to show up right here. See as I move in, as I move this transducer in, I'm walking that signal. A 45 degree signal up and we can see right here as I move in that's my corner trap see this little tip coming up that tip that is the tip of this of this EDM notch it's radiating ringing out and what I'm going to do I'm going to hit my peak memory and I'm going to move back and forth and there, we're peaking. That's the peak of that tip. So let me turn off peak memory. Let me move my gate over to capture that signal. I don't want to capture my corner trap because uh, it will. that's the uh, uh, thickness of the plate. Take 8% full screen height and look at my signal. My depth is 0.698, basically 0.7 inches. So it's saying that the tip of this EDM notch is 0.7 inches down from the from the uh, top surface. 
0.7 inches down. So if I take my total thickness is 1 inch, subtract 0.7 inches, that leaves me with 0.3 inches. And 0.3 inches, that's, I'm only off by two thousandths of an inch, half a sheet of paper thickness. Um, so that right there is the tip diffracted signal.